All right, and welcome back, guys, to another episode of Shit's Minecraft. It's TJ with the Inebriation Nation, with you as always. Uh, when we left off, we were building this little dance club. We got our pretty little bar over here. It's looking pretty. It's pretty, looking pretty sexy. I mean, we don't have. I, I don't know how to craft any actual liquor bottles to put up here, but boy, it looks good as hell. Like if I wanted to put liquor up there, that's where it's gonna damn go. Here's our little bar top, looking pretty sexy. People can't really get to it. They can't get back here because I got this little. Ooh, boy, look at that. That is fucking. That is where form and function meet right there, boy. That looks good as shit. All right, so we were working on the uh, the roof. I want it to be pretty open, but because I'm not really as smart as I act, it's an even number, so it's just not going to look good. So what we're going to do is we're going to... We've decided that I'm just going to go ahead and add a little bit of glass up here, boy. Just add a little glass. Glass it up, because we don't want it raining on us while we're partying, man. Who wants glass? Who wants rain in their face when they fucking try to dance? Not me. I ain't having that. And I've already decided what we're going to do with the floor. We're going to put this little dance floor in here. Oh, man, it's going to look good. You guys don't even know. I know y'all want to come party, but it's invitation only. It's invitation only. If you're not my friend, you can't come. And I don't know if you guys know this. I don't have that many friends. So, boy, it's going to be a real sad party, boy. So, anyway, you guys, been having a, I had a rough day today. You know? I worked hard. I went to school. I made some things happen with school, but I had some girl problems. You know, I know I talk a lot of shit about not really knowing any girls or... Uh, you know, being a weird, you know, uh, a hermit and shit, but that's not true, it's just a character I play, you know, I'm a pretty social guy, I like to spend a lot of time outside, spend time with a lot of friends, friends are real important to me, and, uh, there was a girl, she was real important to me as well, and, uh, I, uh, I, I just, guys, I don't deal with lies, you know, if you're gonna lie to me, I can't deal with it, you know, um, the honesty is a big thing to me. And if you're going to lie, then uh, I can't deal with it. That being said, also can't deal with once I've, I've, I've put that foot down. I can't deal with you making out with other dudes in front of me. You know, I got to go to school with you still. I got to work with you still. I can't deal with that kind of shit. That shit kind of sucks for me. And uh, <clears throat> let me just say this. I'm not going to dump on you. I'm not going to fucking, uh, uh, you know, give you my life story. I'm just going to say that. When it's all said and done, I know that I did the best I could. And you're a good girl, but you've got a lot of growing up to do. And uh, when, you, when you're done growing up, uh, you know, I really don't, don't call me. Because uh, I don't think I can help you anymore. So, you're a lovely girl. I appreciate the time that we had together, and I will never forget it. But uh, I'm going to take care of me. And I've got to worry about school only. School and work, and that is it, man. Other than that, enough serious shit, guys. Because, uh, that's not, that is not what sh shit's Minecraft's about. It's about having a good time. Well, damn it. Let's go build another freaking damn stupid shovel. Stone shovel. Who builds stone shovels? Not me. Well, I do sometimes. When I have to, I suppose. I have to build stone shovels, I suppose. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna dig out the ground here. We're gonna dig it out. We're gonna build a dance floor, boy. We're gonna build us, build us a damn dance floor. It's gonna be the sexiest damn dance floor you ever seen. <clears throat> so uh, <clears throat> who's been working late as hell? Man, I work so late, guys. It's four o'clock in the morning right now. Y'all don't even know about that. Y'all know about four o'clock in the morning. Y'all all asleep in bed with your loved ones, with your girlfriends, your husbands. Your kids, not me. I just got home from work, and uh, I'm sleepy, but I can't go to sleep right away. It takes me a little bit of, a little bit of time to go ahead and, you know, wind down, gather my thoughts, put my brain to sleep. My brain don't go to bed in three seconds, man. It just don't. Let's see, sand. Boy, let's go put some sand over here. Sand gonna go right there. Bam. All right. I, you know, I don't know that we're going to have enough um, of this light, this light wood. No, shit. That's not the right color. I want to put the light wood down. Oh, yeah. As a matter of fact, I know we're not going to. This is going to be the dance floor wood. How is there... 
It is daytime. How am I hearing a zombie right now? That is not okay. Zombie, get your ass out of here, boy. We gotta finish this floor. Alright, that's cool. Let's go. Let's get out of here. We're gonna go find us. We gotta find us the right kind of trees now. Ooh, I see one. See two. Yeah, it just kind of it adds a little extra something to the game now that these uh these birch trees or whatever they want to call them give you a different type of wood. So I mean, I, I guess I understand it. I just gotta get used to it because before it was, you know, once you rendered the the planks, it was always just one type, you know. And now I gotta now I gotta deal with that, man. You know, I just I don't like the thing, guys. It's too much. It's too much to worry about. It's too much to worry. I got a question, guys. Whenever a girl owes you money when you're together, when you're in a relationship, but she don't pay it back, and you're okay with that because obviously you're in a, you're in a relationship, and you don't you don't want to be a dick, you know? You're together. You know, you work together on things, and if she owes you 20 bucks, 30 bucks, that's not a big deal, because you're in a relationship together. But when you break up, does that, does it or does it not, does that 20 or 30 bucks become a big deal? Tell me. Just, you know, leave me a comment. Tell me how you feel. You know, have you ever broke up with a girl and been like, that 20 bucks, I want that 20 bucks back now. What do you do? Do you just, you know, swallow the 20 bucks and just don't worry about it? Or do you say something, hey girl, you still owe me $20. What do you do? Let me know. Because I, I, I went ahead and went with the ladder on that. I was like, yo, girl, you owe me 20 bucks. And she going to come at me trying to act like, I've, like I'm an asshole. Like I'm an asshole. When I went out of my way to make sure that girl had everything she needed, including that 20 bucks, and now I'm a dick because we broke up because of her lying ass. And now I am the asshole because now I want my 20 bucks back. I just don't feel like that's a, that should even be an issue, you know? Anyway, <clears throat> enough of that. Enough of that. This ain't, you know, this ain't what you think it is. This is just us having a good time. You know, I'm a dumbass. What? I'm pretty, but I am not smart. I think we've already been down this road. I am not smart at all, boy. Ah. Get out of here, flower. I'm done with you. Anyway, just so you guys know, I still care about this girl, but I can't do nothing about it. She's younger than me. It's my fault for dating somebody so young. She was pretty, she was smart, she was laid back, and I like girls like that, you know, I have a thing for hippie girls, but hippie girls, man, they crazy as hell, man, and uh, they free-spirited, man, they free-spirited as hell, which means it's pretty much a nice way of saying they will fucking leave you and move on quick as shit, boy, because <laughs> they free-spirited. Which means anybody will do. <laughs> That's what that means. It means anybody will do, boy. They said their relationship is free. <laughs> anyway, now I don't mean to say bad things about it because she is a sweet girl, man. But boy, she somewhere out of my heart, man. If you ain't seen my, if you my friend and you have or haven't seen my Facebook status, I pretty much said that I had an epiphany today, and I said, girls, 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 man, they will use you until you are unwilling to give. And then they will rip your heart from your chest and give it to the next guy who laughs hysterically thinking it's funny, thinking that it's a constellation prize, unaware that he's the next victim. And I think that's, I don't know, I think that's pretty pretty profound. I had a moment, ooh boy, look at this bar here. He's just, a, you know, he's just a young kid. And what sucks is I'm a relatively older guy and I was dating a younger girl. And that's all well and good, but now she's dating some dude look like Justin Bieber. So fucking, she, you know, who, that should be a heads up for me. Who, well, how am I going to date some girl that likes Justin Bieber? She loves Justin Bieber, and I should have known that, man. I'm into Pearl Jam and Smashing Pumpkins, and this girl's into Justin Bieber. I should have known better, boy. That is my own damn fault. That is my own damn fault. You guys can fucking knock me all day, and I can't even be mad at you because I did it myself. I'm in a, she's in a Justin fucking Bieber. Are you fucking kidding me? Anyway, you guys are awfully nice. <laughs> We're having a listen to all this bullshit. <clears throat> As you can see, our little dance club coming together, boy. Now we got to work on the front. The front's coming next, boy. Because we got all this inside. We got a little bar. We got a little door here. Oh, we got our dance floor. Mm -hmm. Time to dance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, I gotta pause it. Have a fantastical, magical day full of wonder and bewilderment. May all your hopes and dreams come true. Remember to thank God every day for yoga pants. A peace out.